Today we'll be reading Peanut the Poodle. As you listen, make sure you listen for the five W's and how. Jason was excited for the school bell to ring. He couldn't wait to get home because today was a very special day. Jason's mom and dad were going to take him to the pet shop after school. Today, he would get to pick out his very own pet. When Jason got to the pet shop, he looked around at all the different kinds of animals. He saw white rabbits, colorful fish, and sleepy puppies. Jason's mom liked watching the fish swim around in the water. Jason's dad liked petting the furry rabbits, but Jason thought the sleepy puppies were the best of all. Jason couldn't stop watching a tiny brown poodle in the pet shop window. The shop owner let Jason hold the tiny poodle in his arms. The poodle licked Jason's face, and he knew that this was the perfect pet for him. Jason's mom and dad bought a dog bed, dog food, dog treats, and the tiny brown puppy asleep in Jason's arms. They all got into the car, and they headed home. Later that night, Jason and his family sat down to eat peanut butter and jelly sandwiches for dinner. Jason's mom said, do you hear something coming from the living room? The family got up from the table to see the tiny brown poodle laying on the floor, licking peanut butter right out of the jar. Everyone started to laugh and Jason said, I will name her Peanut because she loves peanut butter. Jason's parents thought that was the perfect name for the little puppy with peanut butter all over her face. Okay, now turn to the back and take a look at your five W and how questions. Number one, who wanted Jason to get a fish as a pet? Number two, what was the puppy doing when the family was eating dinner? Number three, when did Jason's mom and dad take him to the pet store? Number four, where was the puppy when Jason found him licking the peanut butter? Number five, why was Jason so excited at the beginning of the story? Number six, how do you think Jason felt when he got to the pet store? And number seven is a bonus. If you were Jason, what would you have named the puppy? Don't forget to tell why. Do your very best work.